Good evening, everybody. It's me, Lumi and Fisher. We're trying something different today. Um, we're all at a point in our life and stuff when we have to cross down that road, like the one behind me, and we have to make a move on into the future. Of well, sometimes we don't know where we're going, but we can only guess where we've been. Now. What I mean by that is, is that there's just, just so many things going on in the world around me. Um, nobody knows what the future holds. I don't know. Michelle doesn't know. I, I have no idea. Neither does she. But we're going to keep trying to do the things that we're good at. And uh, we're going to keep working on the techniques and our talents and our skills. And that's what we're going to do. The road, I mentioned the road because that's the path we came from. And now we're moving into a new uncharted territory. We're no longer doing just simple pictures of us sitting in front of a microphone and looking pretty. Yeah, we still have a microphone. Yeah, we still have the lace. Yeah, we still have the studio. We're still doing that. But this is the first time we've ever decided to do something different. Just leave this road behind me. I could walk down that road, go back where I came from. But that's not going to help because that's going to just limit us. We got to compete with millions, if that, more than that, of YouTube submissions every day. And Michelle has put a lot of work into what she's doing. But even Michelle is never sure what's going to happen next. For example, there is a possibility that because of situations that are outside of our control that we might have to relocate again after we work so hard to establish our studio and and all the new equipment and new technology we are finding ourselves potentially um, being uh, at the mercy of another landlord situation where things are uncertain. It's not because of anything we did, but because of the fact is that he's not behaving as a landlord should and he's not doing the things that he should be doing. So like I said, I want this, me and Michelle are on this path and we have to decide if we go ahead, which means towards you, or do we go back there? And just forget about everything that we've done and just basically fade away into the woodwork of mediocrity. I worked hard to get where I am and Michelle's worked hard too. I know I don't have very many users and I don't have many, many people who subscribe to my channel. But I do know I have people who at least watch the videos. And Michelle, hell. She's been doing pretty good. She's got like 37 viewers or so. And she's making lives better for people all over the world. Many people look up to us as examples of what you can do if you're willing to take that chance. And that's what we're trying to do. And, uh, you know, that's a tough thing. Michelle wanted to go to Fairbanks, Alaska. She wanted to go to Barrow, Alaska. She wanted to go to Bangor, Maine. She thought about going to Portland, Maine, but she don't think she'd fit in there. Caribou, Maine. All these opportunities that might just be ahead of us if we can make the right decision on the path that is going to be our path for the future. But for right now, we're sort of wondering, for right ahead of us, there is this, a big fork in the road, a big intersection, if you will. And there's three forks, and, and the three forks are all unknown to us. The signpost says, one says, stay where you are and take your chances. Signpost two said, move on and take your chances. And Science Post 3 says just do a 180 degree turn, 
flip back and go the way you went. I don't want to go back the way we went. We came from it's just that's not gonna do anything for us. And we wanna go further. We wanna get ahead. We need to come up with new ideas. New bold ways. And we need to know exactly what in the heaven's name would you like us to do? Michelle's looking for uh, a, a, um, a significant person in her life and there's several potential suitors and she's not sure and I'm not either which one we should take it's just like the three roads I told you about if we stay here and do nothing be just like the north and the south going zacks we're not going to get anywhere we're just standing here I mean do nothing Go back to where you came? That doesn't sound too impressive. Take your chances and move on. <sighs> you know, it's, it's sometimes it's not really easy to do it. Oh, I do see a fourth road, uh, which according Lee's just basically is, is, like I said, just move on and take your chances. Michelle has worked hard on these videos. And I'd like to see us go further ahead. Okay, we're not, you know, copper cap or better known as the angry ginger. We're never going to have a million YouTube viewers. Maybe we might someday, but I don't think so. We're just not the kind of thing that the youngsters are going to want to watch. Despite the fact that we're really serious, we want to move on. We have to. We can't keep going and do nothing. It's killing us. It's robbing us of our psyche. It's taking away our energy, our desire. So maybe I can move out on the way I can go. Or that way I can go this way or I can go no. I can just take a chance and just go straight ahead and see where this road leads us. I think that's the best thing to do. We have to take a chance. We don't know if the apartment is going to be fixed up. The landlady herself is, is taking over control from her husband. And he left her, unfortunately, a lot of problems. We don't know where the future is going to lead us. But I and Michelle have both agreed we have to do something. We can't just do nothing. Stone right stupid. Brothers and sisters, I'm asking all of you to pray for us as we have to deal with the challenges in the months ahead. Some things that are pretty straightforward, simple. Sure, Michelle likes to talk about the technology because she doesn't like to talk about her deep feelings or fears in public a lot. I'm not afraid to talk about my feelings. But, you know, in this case, We'd like to hear what you got to say. Come on, talk to us. Thank you very much for listening.